Hey, what, what am I looking at? Bisky! Bisky! And, and, and that's all you need to know. I, I, I told you, a freak. All right, Hunter Hunter 87, Bisky is back. The boys are training again. We've got this whole situation to deal with to try and get back into NGL. And Netero has pretty much set the tone about where the gravity of the situation really is, that he's not even strong enough to deal with Nefepito. So I've got no idea what's going to happen with all of this. I really think it's going to take its time, which I'm really here for. You know, it's the journey with Hunter Hunter. Uh, I've said it a few times throughout the show. It might not necessarily be where we end up, but it's every Thing that happens in between for us to get to wherever we're going that's the really juicy stuff so I'm just gonna enjoy all of this as much as I can but what I'm really interested in is Nefepito's technique what she's planning to do with Kite and seeing the third royal guard be birthed as well and what the other two guards abilities are gonna be along with Nefepito's it's all really interesting stuff to me I love all the Nen stuff and whilst gonna kill her training as well I love to see them develop their techniques more as well Kite was talking to them about that you know develop your Nen I think at this point we've only seen like the base of the boy's abilities. Like Killua, we've seen him do a few different applications of his lightning. Gone, we've seen rock and scissors at this point. We're still yet to see paper, the emitter version. So there's still so much to happen with all of that and I can't wait to see all of it. Promise and reunion. Who are we making a promise to? Who are we reuniting with? Ah! Oh, Jesus. 250 human meatballs. Oh, that's the king in there, man. I see him. <laughs> Might happen sooner than we think, man. <laughs> Bisky. Bro, I wish I could use Ned the same way I wish I could go Super Saiyan, man. It's just cool. <laughs> Slaughter's a strong word. That, that's not what we're about. Maybe that's what she's about. She's a freak. Hi, okay. Is that three hours? Dude, you can see, like, Gon's shirt is see-through. He's sweating so much. Cookie. <laughs> Come on, come on, at least let them rest. I can't with her, man. She's like the grudge. Ooh, that's good, though. Oh, this is like the tags, man, in the hunter exams. Every day? Okay. Classic Bisky type training, though. But this will be good for them if they keep getting their asses beat. That's going to improve their Nen, man. This guy's so interesting. Oh, the boys. Oh, they're exhausted. They're going to get their asses beat. Hey, you're gonna learn. Maybe not now, but you're gonna learn. I love these graphics they do. To represent, yeah, the presence of their Nen. He really gives me, um, Toto vibes from JJK. Yeah. What's good with this guy? Oh. <laughs> okay, I think he's a very likable character. We'll see if he sticks around, though. 
はあ<笑>格の違いを思い知らせてやるよ。気が済むまで殴らせてやるよ。その代わり、俺がこの場から。Like、割り符を置いてけ。破格の条件だろうがこらてめえらごときが。Or maybe he thinks he's weaker. I don't know. Like, he's saying a lot of things, man. Yeah, okay. Alright. I don't know what's going on. It's classic gone. But we're very tired as well, of course. Hey, he didn't expect this, though. Yeah, you need code. Like, he's stressed, man. Like, use Ken. I, I cannot read this guy at all. I'm all over the place. Well, I, I, we did it. Well, what's good with this guy? I'm so confused, man. Where's shoot? <laughs> 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 I'm starting to think that's the case, Killua. There's one. Nande Toranakata. Warifu Tote Orenanka Hotoga Yoga Tadaroga. Oretachua, Warifuga Hoshinja Nayo Hoshino, Mako Shobu de Nakresan or Tauze, Jitsirokananda. They've done this before. They've done this kind of thing before. Nande Konkai. What, the ants? Yeah, ooh. That's interesting. Makes me think a lot of Gon's character as well. Yeah, I thought, I thought Gon would like that. Oh, dude, there's a lot going on, man. It's the dog! Well liked by animals, man. Well liked by animals. He's a big softy, man. Nah, I like this guy. <laughs> now he can hang around. He can come with us. He might just be fodder, but he can come with us. Yeah, he's cool. He's cool. He's okay. Bro, she needs to stop. I can't. In a straight out fight, maybe that's true. But in the vacuum of just trying to make him move, they could do that. What are we doing? Oh, yep, yep, yep. We're taking him out. We're taking him out. Wait, what does that do? Well, he's got his whole, he's got a room. A Nen room. And Netero's in it. Okay, dude, hold on. This is a sick ability. They're just dropping him off to get smacked by Netero. Does Peggy have Nen? Peggy Loki is my favorite. Don't know. <laughs> Lord, that means Lord, right? Okay. Okay. 
外のことは任せるよ。城内は僕たちが守るから。She's putting it back together, man. もう少し濃度を上げるか。Dude, is she gonna make like a puppet out of him? Oh, dude, if Gon sees that, oh god, it's just gonna be even worse. Oh, Colt's the thinker. Colt and Peggy, man, they're doing it. Okay. See all the games that are going on between them back and forth. So we're playing chess right now, man. Netero doesn't look convinced. Hmm. Yeah, well, they're clearly not. That's all you need to know. Okay. Imagine needing to set three hours aside every day just to hone your ren and then go get smacked up. <laughs> I'm here for this. Nah, he's a good guy. He's a really good guy. It's the same thing. They just don't have their ren showing. Again, it's quite a tone shift. Like episode 85 was so different. Yeah, here we go. Now he's doing stuff. Show me what you got, Knuckle. Ooh. Interesting style. Right, okay. Maybe this is how they get strong enough. Let him know, Knuckle. Make them level up. It's gonna take some time. Is that um shoot? Yeah, that's right. He did do that. Yeah, that's right. He did do that. Yeah, that's right. He did do that. Kind of looks like Nibanaga. I will defeat them. Mm. Another good episode though. Like I said though, we're, we're looking at things very differently. Like episode 85 was just something completely on its own just to let us know where we're at. And now we're just chilling again for a little bit getting stronger. All right, so a big episode for just kind of supplying more context, further setting the tone, just kind of checking in with all the different situations. This knuckle guy, man, I could not get a read on him. I had no idea what was going on with his character. He's a good guy. Like, like I said, I was comparing him to Toto from JJK. And I'm gonna stick with that. I really get that vibe from him. He's a cool guy. And he's gonna be really handy for helping Gon and Killua get stronger. He's already looked at the situation, like, you know, if they can overcome this, like constantly having to fight him while being exhausted, it's gonna give them this massive confidence boost and really increase the rate of growth they're gonna have in terms of strength and Nen. Netro and the other two hunters, man, like I didn't even talk about their Nen abilities from last episode. Some really cool stuff and unique abilities. The homies just dropping ants off into a room that just gives like specialist like that has to be a specialist technique right i don't know what else it could be unless he's like conjured this room or something i don't know how he's like opening up these holes though but he's just got netro in there dropping in ants and netro's taking care of them right this is how they're slowly chipping away at the ants forces and like i said during the episode i love this game that's going on between netro and the other hunters and like colt and peggy like kind of throwing things at each other trying to predict what the next move is going to be i was really curious as to what was going to happen while going to kill over training when netro and that going to go straight in there but no we're, we're doing reconnaissance we're being chill with it there's a really cool way to see things happening while the boys train now this nefepito stuff like she's clearly i don't know what she's got going on like all these machines and everything she's really working on kite putting him back together partly with her technique but i imagine partly with everything else she's got going on unless she's made all of these machines with their technique i don't know but i'm like if she brings kite like back to life and she's like using him as a puppet or something i don't know she makes him strong
stronger so she can use him. Dude, Gon's gonna flip his shit. Like, I, I can't even... Like, it might even be worse than Gon just finding out that Kite is dead. To see that Nefepito could be using Kite, dude, that's gonna be a lot. But we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. Maybe we'll never come to it. That would be nice. I don't know. It would make for an epic moment. Don't get it twisted. I could delve a little bit into Knuckles' character, but I, I might save that for, for down the track, see if he sticks around a bit, because he was doing some interesting things. It was just his overthinking with um Gon's rock, paper, rock, man. But this happens a lot. Like, people don't expect Gon and Killua to be this strong, and then Gon whips out his ability, and all of a sudden, people start shitting themselves. But Knuckle did say, look, you have to, you know, make me move from the spot. So, you know, he did kind of handicap himself a little bit there. Should have just used Ken, man. Like, you know, why take the risk with Ko? He said he could die, man. <laughs> I mean, that's what Bisky said when she was teaching them about Ken and Ko and everything. If you use Ko and you guess wrong, well, you can die. But we'll see. They're still doing a good job of sprinkling in a lot of mystery here and there. Palm, I don't know what's going on with her, man. Like, she's taken a liking to the boys. I don't know. But then she saw Knuckle having a good time and she was like, huh? So I, I, I don't know. She just looks like the grudge, man. Like something out of one of those, like, Asian horror films. Like, I, I, no, 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 no. But I think I'm going to leave this one here. I don't feel the need to go into too much from this episode. Like, I'm not going to lie. I'm just chasing my next episode 85, man. Like, we've dropped off a bit because, you know, we have to. And it's all necessary. And I'll gladly go through another build-up to get me another one of those episodes, man. But, like, I'm, I'm ready for it, man. I'm keen. They've given me a taste. Now I just want to keep experiencing, man. So thank you all so much for watching. We'll see you on the next episode.